Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Beep It Live. It's Monday, so that means it's Motivation Monday, and time to get your at-home workout on with Beep It Ambassador Roy Montez and his guest, Senior Master Sergeant Sonia Berry. Good morning, Leah, guys. So nice, to, nice to see you again, Leah. Good to see you. Good to see you, Sergeant Berry. How are you doing? Did we lose her? I think we lost Sergeant Barry. Roy, do you have anything you want to share with us while we sure. give Sergeant Barry just a few minutes? Anything you want to share about maybe the community hub? Or... Sure. So, uh, again, welcome everyone. Uh, as y'all slowly tune in, um, we'll go ahead and uh, go through an intro here. So every Monday, like Leah mentioned, uh, at 11 a.m. our time, uh, we go through a live workout uh, that basically highlights the foundation movements and uh, the strong principles of fitness, uh, some of the essential movements that you can do at home while we're at home uh, to get your body moving, get your body active, and used to uh, if you're if you're seated at home or if you've you know been traveling uh, longer distance than usual, now is a great time to keep your body moving, uh, keep your body active, and stay healthy. Uh, we carry a lot of workouts that are uh, on located on the hub, which is you can visit that at shopmyexchange forward slash be fit, where we had a we have a lot of fitness, and nutrition, and uh, a lot of articles that you can read and oversee and, and view there to where we basically holistically approach fitness, health, and wellness uh, right there on the hub. So those, those sites, those articles you can visit and, and take in there and, and, and let us know what you think. We also recap a lot of our workouts that we hold on Mondays and we put them on the hub for your review. You can see step-by-step -step instructions on how to uh, how to uh, basically uh, do each movement and um, just let us know. Let us know what you think. Also, let us know what you're visiting from, where you're watching from, where you're at, whether you're at home, or whether you're going to do the, doing the workout with us. Let us know. Comment in the comments below and, and let us know where you're viewing from. Okay, Roy, let me check the comments real quick and see what we have. Uh, I was just sending Sergeant Barry a note real quick. Copy. So let's see what we have going on here. I don't see her back in the waiting room just yet. That's okay. And again, if you're joining us, now's a great time to uh, focus on hydration. If you are uh, going to work out with us, make sure and stay hydrated. I have a few essentials of uh, myself. Smart water is what I'm going to be uh, sipping on today, as well as um, uh, some branch chain amino acids for uh, an intro workout. <clears throat> and just to highlight for everyone watching at home, I hope you had a great breakfast. Again, nutrition is an important part to uh, staying healthy and uh, living a, an, a healthy and active lifestyle. So nutrition and as well as a good night's rest, sleep, nutrition, and fitness will round about our holistic uh, points for this workout. Okay, so it looks like Roy, um, we do have one question. Sandy sure. says, how are you managing the heat? Great question, Sandy. So hydration is key. Hydration is key uh, just to keep our bodies, uh, you know, it, we're about 65, 70% uh, made up of water. So uh, 
hydration is going to be key to keeping our muscles, to keeping our mental clarity and focus sustainable. Uh, during the heat, uh, you're, you're going to perspire. You're going to expel some of those, uh, some of that water that your body intakes. So just proper hydration uh, is key. Not not only proper hydration, but also articles. that you wear, um, you know, try to wear loose clothing as, as well as <clears throat> a hat. If you're in direct sunlight, uh, wear, wear a hat to keep yourself protected and exposed from the sun. And on top of that, what you can also do is wear sunscreen. Uh, sunblock that can help UV rays will be uh, fantastic for not only uh, health reasons, but also to uh, protect your skin. Awesome. Roy, I still don't see Sergeant Barry, but I think sure. you think go ahead and start warming up. And yeah, then if she yeah. hops on, then she can join you back. Absolutely. Absolutely. We have a, a few minutes to go before the actual workout. So just like any, any introduction to our bodies, we want to start to prime our bodies, get our body and our mind ready to focus and ready to uh, tackle the task at hand. So uh, Leah, we're going to go through some dynamic stretching as opposed to static stretching, or we can stretch multiple muscle groups at a time here. So if you're watching here, we're going to run through some dynamic stretching here. So we'll start off with knee tucks here. We're going to clasp our hands together, raise our knee to our chest and squeeze. We're going to get those hip flexors and that psoas region right here. If you've been sitting for a while, uh, you may be tight in this region. Uh, you may feel a little bit of a lower back stress here. So stretching out your hip flexors and your psoas can really help while sitting for a long period of time here. So knee tucks, we'll do a few per side. Nice and slow here, nice and smooth. Really just priming our bodies here, priming our bodies, getting our body ready to work here. Okay, let's go into some hip mobility here. Let's loosen out our hips and open them up with nice big circles here. Left leg and right leg. Again, if we've been sitting for a while, it's, it's Monday, we're coming off of the weekend. It's time to work. It's time to get back into the swing of things. We may have sat for a little longer than we would have liked. So let's go ahead and loosen up this body, loosen up our hips here. All right, let's move from outside to inside. Hip circles here. All right, nice and smooth. No rush here. All right, let's move into some straight leg kicks here. We're gonna focus on stretching out our hamstring here. as well as working on flexibility. A few more here. Try and keep that knee nice and straight. Keep those legs straight here. Okay, one of my personal favorites here, we're gonna go into a squat with our hands under our toes or as far down as you can. We are gonna work on squatting down here with our chest and our head in a neutral position, nice and forward here, nice and forward. So we'll extend all the way back up to the top and lower right back down. You really feel your hips, your glutes, your quads, your knees. Open up here, let's prime that body. A little nice, nice and smooth here. Once you start feeling warm, you can Go a little bit quicker at your pace. All right, from here, let's go into some jumping jacks here. This is gonna be a modified version to one of the exercises that we'll tackle today. All right, feeling warm, feeling warm. Let's go into some butt kicks here. Get 
that body nice and nice and warm here, nice and warm as if it's not warm outside already. Let's go into some high knees. Sergeant Barry, you're back. I am back. Sorry. All right. Awesome. I'll just jump right in. All though. right. Welcome back, Sergeant Barry. Hi, sorry about that. <laughs> okay. Roy. No, you're fine. You're fine. We just finished up our dynamic stretching. I'm sure um, I'm sure we feel nice and warm, okay? So, um, all right, well, let's go ahead and uh, start the timer here. And we'll go into our first exercise. Let me cover the first four. So no need to worry about reps. Uh, we're going off of an interval count here, interval, interval timing. So we'll, we're gonna work for 40 seconds and then we're gonna take a 20 second rest. We're gonna run through four exercises today. Our first exercise is gonna be a lunge. Our second, side, our second exercise is gonna be a jumping jack modified to a reverse fly. Our third will be a single leg RDL, single leg, single leg Romanian deadlift. And our fourth will be a mountain climber. So our lunge will be focused here on our quad and our glute, okay forward lunges here for 40 seconds. Our jack to reverse fly, like a squat. We're gonna open up, bring our toes, our feet, and our hands together, and then back into a squat, and together at the hands. Yes, ma'am, that's it. Let's work, what I want you to work is focusing on that contraction on the back, like a reverse fly, to really bring in our shoulder blades, our mid to upper back is where you'll feel that opening up and the very wide at that bottom position here, and then back up to the top. Our single leg RDL, we're gonna balance on one foot. With no weight, we will lower it down, feeling that stretch in our hamstring and our glutes. That's what I want you to focus on is that stretch and isolation on your hamstring, okay? And when you rise back up, thrust forward from that glute, and that'll be the top. Nice and smooth here, no rush here. 20 seconds on each leg here. That'll equal, that will leave us at that 40 second and mountain climbers to work our core. We're gonna start at a high plank position and then at your pace, bring those knees to the chest here. Okay, for 40 seconds. All right. Okay, sounds good. Let me start the uh, timer real quick and uh, we'll get ready to work. Okay, grab some water if you are with me. Now's a great time to towel off if you're hot like I am. And 10 seconds on the clock here. Lunges in five. Three, two, one, let's work here. There you go. Let's work on There you go, Sergeant Barry. We should feel that contraction in our quad. Our glutes should be working. Hands can be out in front of you. Hands on the hips. Or out to the side. One and time. 40 seconds of work is done. 20 seconds of rest here and then we'll go into reverse uh, to jacks with reverse fly here. 10 more seconds. Sandy, you mentioned hydration. Hydration is key, especially out in 90, de 90 degree weather. <laughs> okay, 40 seconds on the clock, let's go. There we go, nice and smooth. Work on opening up that chest. Let's keep our head, our neck and our spine in a straight line here. Hinge at the hips, seat back, 20 seconds of work left. Nice and smooth here. 
You should feel your quads and your glutes start to warm up here. Five more seconds of work. Open up, own it. Nice. 20 seconds of rest. There we go, there we go. All right, single leg RDL coming up next. Let's work on our balance, isolating our hamstring. Three, two, one. All right, here we go here. Nice and smooth here. So let's work on isolating our hamstring here. Let's go at our own pace for 20 seconds on one leg and then we'll switch to so to the leg here. And switch. Okay, if you need assistance, go ahead and grab a chair, a table, a couch, anything that can help you balance if you find trouble balancing. Good, one and time. All right, 20 seconds of rest, and then we'll move into mountain climbers. My balance is better on my right side, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> you, you, you will find that that balance can, can be more advanced on one side than the next year. 40 seconds here. Mountain climbers for 40 seconds. We wanna extend our legs all the way out Focusing on driving that knee to your chest here. Keep that core nice and tight, engaged at all times. Work on contracting your core here. This will help a lot with stability as well as balance <laughs> and moving from side to side. One and time. Awesome, good work. That's Round good. one is in. <laughs> Roy, we just have one comment right now. Yes, Robin Williams says, drink up, Roy. It's getting hot out there. Robin, <laughs> you're absolutely right. I will take a page that you've requested and I will drink up. Uh, we're currently sitting at about, oh, what did I check this morning? Between 90, 90 degrees right now with the humidity of... <laughs> north of 50 percent so you will see me sweat a lot out here and again these are workouts that you can do with very minimal space or if you have a lot of room to play with uh you can take full advantage of the space that you have um but you know as you can see we're not working at any more than six feet around here five more seconds and we'll go into a lunch here robin thanks for watching okay let's work alternating lunges here. Again, I want you to focus on absorbing with your quad, which is right up here and extending back out. You'll feel that a little bit in your posterior chain, your hamstring and your calf and absorb up top by your glute. There we go, 10 more seconds of work. Three, and time. All right, awesome work. And for everybody watching, if you're just joining us, what you're tuning into is a BeFit live workout with BeFit Ambassador Roy Montez. So this is designed to be an at-home workout with minimal equipment to no equipment at all. And these are every Monday at 11 a.m. And they're also designed so that if you're not able to work out live at that point that you can come back you can save the video and come back later great highlights leah again yes you know we, we can do these inside outside indoor outdoor you can really take advantage of the wonderful weather that you may be having today or the wonderful ac that your house may be blowing today <laughs> five more seconds of work here Two, one, great job, great job. And again, this is, we, we just wanna keep our body moving. I know things are, are, are different and um, 
keeping our body moving, keeping our mind uh, just at the same fitness as our bodies is as imperative and important. So single leg RDLs, here we go. Feel that stretch in your hamstring, 20 seconds on one foot here. Nice and smooth. Five more seconds on one foot. There we go. And let's switch. Here's a tip. What really helps to um, work on balance is to focus on one object, one item in front of you, whether it be a wall, a spot on the wall, a chair, a blade of grass, anything, and time. Work on focusing on one object and uh, you seem to get rid of the imbalance that you may have and it'll help with balancing on one foot and extending down. Excellent tip, Roy. Excellent for people who are challenged with balance. <laughs> All right, mountain climbers for 40 seconds. Here we go. All right. Now this can be at your own pace here. If you want to speed it up and you're comfortable with doing so, you can really work on Really work on speed here. Really work on hitting your core. Really lighting it up here. 18 more seconds of work. This has a similar motion to running in place. So again, your heart rate's gonna be up, elevated. Your core is gonna be engaged, nice and tight. You'll feel it through your arms. Two, one, time. <laughs> And hydration. Again, wipe, wipe down and hydrate if you are indoor or outdoor. It's gonna be key as we start warming up through this winter. Okay, I'm gonna add some resistance to this next lunge. So if you have a dumbbell, if you have water, if you have anything with a handle, you can simulate this lunge with weighted resistance here. Okay. We have uh, 13 more seconds of rest, Sergeant Barry. Oh. Let's, let's catch our breath. <laughs> Five more seconds here. Okay, let's work. <laughs> this is just bonus, yeah. yeah. <laughs> she should. She gets extra credit for that. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I'll show you right, the last one. <laughs> there we go. There we go. I like your alternating leg approach there, Sergeant Barry. Two, one, and time. 20 seconds of rest here. Okay, Jack's reverse fly and 10. Again, what's nice about interval training is you don't have to worry specifically on the amount of reps that you hit. We're just working off of time here. So 40 seconds on and 20 seconds off. And our 40 seconds begins now. Jack's reverse fly. We'll work on sitting back in our imaginary chair here. Our knees wanna be tracking over our toes and our hands wanna to come together and spread out nice and wide to contract in that mid to upper back here. Our head wants to be neutral and a facing forward position along with our chest. Let's try not to arch our back nice and forward here. Seven seconds here. Left, two, one. Time. Good work, good work. Checking my heart rate here with a nice fitness tracker here, but a monitor. <laughs> Single leg RDLs in five. 100, Roy, you're working. All right. What is it? 100. It's 120. 100. 
Sergeant Barry said hers is 120, I think. 120, okay. Mm -hmm. And if you need help slowing down, obviously you can pause and break at any time. You can also work on your breathing. Deep breaths, deep long breaths, inward and outward, will help on controlling and slowing down your heart rate. All right, five more seconds. And time. All right. <laughs> my, I'll tell you, my average heart rate throughout the day is 45. So we know we're working here. Mountain climbers in five, three, and let's work. Nice. Let's drive those knees to our chest. 20 more seconds. Let's push through. Extend those legs. Drive those feet, drive those knees. 10 more seconds to go here. We can do it. Keep your core contracted. Nice and tight. Three more seconds. Push through. And time. All right. <laughs> It's a good, good in-place cardio workout for sure. Good work, exactly. Between the lunge, the jacks, we'll keep your cardio up, mountain climbers cardio, isolating our hamstring and glute on that single leg RDL. We're really working on lower body and cardio here. So target lower body cardio. And again, what's, 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 if you're looking for a muscle group to work out and you have limited time, Incorporating your lower body, the largest muscle group in your body. It, it takes a lot of effort, a lot of effort to, to get that body moving with your lower body. So if you're looking for a muscle group to work, that's the part right there. Limited time. All right. Lunges in five here. Last set, best set. Let's finish strong here. Hey, good. There we go. Nice and big. Make sure our knee and our foot are at a 90 degree bend here when you come down into this lunge. You wanna push up through your heel and back up to your starting position. 12 more seconds of work. And you can isolate up and down right here, and time. If you lunge all the way back to the top, maybe too challenging. Again, just stick, stick right here to this lunge, nice and isolated. Really focusing on your quad and your glute at the top, opposing. All right, jacks the reverse fly, and time. Let's work here. Again, what I want you to focus on here is sitting back in that chair. Your knees want to track over your toes. Bring yourself up to the top here. And really working on squeezing your back at that bottom. Contracting your back, your mid to upper back here. 15 more seconds of work. And you can go at your own pace here. Let's make sure we're nice and forward, nice and tall. Chest and head forward. Three, two, one, time. Okay. Let's focus on, focus on our breathing for a second. Gather ourselves and single leg RDLs are up next. And three, two, one, let's work. All right. I'm keeping my head, my neck, and my spine in a neutral position here, trying to focus on a straight line from my neck all the way to my tailbone. As I'm lowering, I'm focusing on one item on the carpet. 14, 
I'm gonna switch legs here midway through. Again, you should feel the stretch in your hamstring. Raise up, squeeze those glutes together. Nice and smooth. Two, one, and time. Okay. Home stretch here, Sergeant Barry. Right. Our favorite mountain climbers to finish out for the win. <laughs> okay, five more seconds. Two, one. All right, let's finish out. 40 seconds of work here. Again, we wanna focus on driving our legs back and to our chest, all the way back and to our chest, as far as you can go here, wherever your comfort level may be. Take it nice and slow or progress and accelerate to your speed. 10 more seconds of work here. Five, let's finish strong. There we go. And time. Nice work. <laughs> nice work. Yeah, thank you. Again, for anybody watching, interval training right here with Sergeant Barry, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds on, in a less than 20 minute workout is all we needed to break a sweat, get our heart rate elevated to burn those extra calories, working on strength and conditioning here, stability, flexibility. I think we tackled it all in this one. <laughs> Good job, you guys. Excellent. <laughs> awesome, thank you, Leah. I don't see any questions on, on Facebook, but I do see that Army MWR is watching and they say they're sharing this on their feed. Oh. Fantastic. It's always nice, MWR. Thanks for joining us. Thanks for sharing and supporting. Blake says, good morning from Kansas City. Good morning, Blake. Thanks for joining BFIT Live. I wish you a great Monday. Let's kick off this Monday strong. And Jen says, hi from NASJRB Fort Worth. Jen, nice to, nice to see you. Nice to see you joining us. Thank you. Mm -hmm. A big hello. How are you doing, Sergeant Barry? How was that workout? That was a good one, Liam, for sure. My heart rate's still dropping a little bit, so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how Roy does it outside because I'm in the AC and I'm dying. Who so. you knows? 15. So, again, I'm working on hydration during these summer times, this summer heat. Roy, do you have go. any last words before we go? Um, you know, Leah, I just like to um, touch base on what we mentioned this uh, earlier during our workout before we started. That all workouts can be fine can be found on Shop My Exchange forward slash Be Fit, and we'll post that link somewhere in the comments below for you to surf and visit at a later date. You can find a recap of this workout plus all of our previous workouts. Plus, addi plus additional support from BFIT Ambassadors. We highlight nutrition, any goals uh, that you might want to achieve. We um, work on breaking down uh, BFIT tips and motivation for you. So we try and highlight everything there at the hub that you would need to help sustain or start a healthy lifestyle. From nutrition, if you visit any one of our exchange restaurants over seven. 1,700, more than 1,700 restaurants here, uh, you'll find better for you options that each one of these restaurants can provide for you. Uh, no matter your goals, uh, surf their menus, look for that low cal, high protein, uh, or low carb meal uh, that will help sustain and, and, and hit the uh, macros that you're wishing to achieve. Um, visit our exchange restaurants. And if you're at any of our express stores, we make it a little bit more simpler by including healthier choice tags that we tag on products that are deemed a uh, healthier option for you. Uh, that can be anything from meat snacks to again, any hydration uh, such as water, uh, fruits, uh, any, any type of nut snack. 
and uh, anything from big meals in our freezers down to uh, surfing the aisles. Look for that green healthier choice tag and, and we'll help you out there. And we're always here to support you. So uh, Be Fit Nation, we're here to support. Excellent. Well, thank you both so much for coming on and doing your workout live with our audience. Hope you have a good rest of your day. And to everybody watching, thanks for joining us. And we will see you next Monday back here at 11 a.m. Central Time. All right. See you soon, guys. Thank you, Leah. Thank you, everyone who joined in. Bye.